Ever wonder why chocolate is a symbol of love and romance? It may be because it can help to boost heart health and have a positive effect on mood. Today we're gonna to make a delicious recipe that's perfect for any romantic evening, frozen berries with a chocolate date fudge. This dessert is a great way to enjoy chocolate with less calories and some extra antioxidants thanks to the berries. So let's get started. Okay, so ingredients you will need for today are some assorted berries. You need some skewers to put those berries on. A good dark chocolate, at least 70%. You can even use dark cocoa powder. Uh, some dates, about seven or eight dates pitted. And some almond milk or any sort of milk or milk alternative. Okay, now we're ready to skewer those berries. We have a really nice selection here. We got some blackberries, some raspberries, some blueberries to make sure that color really, really pops. So you can choose about three or four and you just want to skewer them and alternate them. One of the great things about berries is they contain antioxidants called anthocyanins, which may help to reduce your risk of heart disease, Alzheimer's disease, and cancer. It's fantastic. And these are going to be delicious. So do as many as you can, and then you want to stick them in the freezer and let them chill for about 30 minutes until they're ready to dip in that dark chocolate date fudge. Okay, so for our luxurious dark chocolate fudge, uh, we want to bring a couple cups of almond milk. You can use any milk milk alternative for this. Uh, we want to bring it up to a simmer. So that's just a very, very slow rolling boil. You don't want to heat it up too much, otherwise it might start to separate. And we're going to go ahead and add our pitted dates, and we're going to add some dark chocolate. Now, Christy, you mentioned before about dark chocolate affecting your mood. How does that do that exactly? There's a couple ways. So. Cocoa and chocolate, they help to increase the levels of serotonin in the brain. And serotonin is a chemical messenger that helps put people in a good mood. It also contains phenethylamine, which is another type of chemical that promotes feelings of pleasure or feeling good. Ah, excellent. So, more dark chocolate then. We're going to let that simmer just for about a minute, and then we're going to go ahead and blend it into our dark chocolate fudge. So, we talked about how chocolate can help boost your mood. But did you know that chocolate is also a heart healthy food? No way. It's true. Chocolate contains flavanols, antioxidants that may help to protect the heart and the blood vessels. The flavanols work by preventing your blood platelets from clumping together, which reduces your risk of heart attack and stroke. Flavanols also increase blood flow to the heart and the brain. That's great news. So for our dark, dark chocolate fudge, it's ready to go. Uh, just taking it off the simmer and we're gonna add it to our blender. Remember, like any hot liquid that you're gonna to about to blend, make sure that you start it off slow and make sure you have a dish towel handy to put on top. Otherwise, that dark chocolate is gonna end up all over your ceiling. And it'll be difficult to eat. Okay. All right. Okay, so that dark chocolate is done. You can smell how rich it is, and it's a perfect ingredient to add to anything like this. And like you mentioned, going for that 70% or higher cocoa content with your chocolate bars, a great idea for flavor, but also from a nutrition point of view, that means you're gonna get the most flavanols in your chocolate with that higher cocoa content. It's win-win. Yeah, it's also a good idea when you're picking out your chocolate bar, you wanna check out the ingredient list and make sure that the main fat in it is cocoa butter and that you're not gonna choose one that is higher in some of the hydrogenated fats. So check out those ingredients and avoid the ones that say partially hydrogenated or hydrogenated oil. Yeah, that one tastes very good. So that's it, ready to go, that thick, dark chocolate date fudge, and we're gonna let it cool a little bit and then drizzle it all over those frozen berries. So our dark chocolate and date fudge is ready. It's cooled down a little bit. We have our berry skewers out of the freezer and we're ready for that drizzle. So just get a spoon and you can, you can go as crazy as you want or as light as you want. You can dip the whole skewer in the chocolate. There's great news for chocolate lovers out there. The research actually supports that you can have one ounce of dark chocolate three or four times a week. That's this amount right here. And the research showed that this can help to lower blood pressure and make your blood vessels work better. All good things for heart health. That is fantastic news. So these skewers are ready. Now because the skewers are frozen, 
That dark chocolate will seize pretty quickly on there, but you can also set them in the freezer for them to chill a little bit more. Uh, but they're delicious. They look delicious. They're gonna taste delicious. And for even more delicious recipes, you can check out our YouTube page and be sure to subscribe.